You may have heard of the swab your throat trend going around on social media. It's a movement by people to use at home rapid tests to detect the Omicron variant of COVID-19, which doctors say often presents with symptoms that include sore throat. And some people have found that they test negative when swabbing their nose, but positive when swabbing their throat. Now that sounds a bit strange, and there is limited scientific evidence to back up this method. During yesterday's COVID-19 briefing, Maine CDC Director Dr. Nirav Shah said his staff has asked the U.S. CDC about this. He said they told him the guidance has not changed. Either the nose or throat are viable specimens. Dr. Shah said the evidence from one study out of South Africa was very strong in showing that a throat swab was superior to a nose swab. And given that if you're at home, it's six and one half dozen the other, no matter where you swab, if it were me, I would swab in the back of the throat, not in the nose. Individuals have to make a decision that's best for them. The US CDC has indicated that the nasal specimen still remains effective. There, there is no clear and right answer here, Mel. I'll tell you, if it were me, I would go with the back of the throat, but other individuals may decide to go with the nose. Keep in mind, any at-home tests do not get reported to the state. So if you test positive, the CDC asks you to send them the result and then isolate at home for at least five days, regardless of your vaccination status.